France, and we have seen now a, um, each problem, each looted painting had to be solved almost individually by attacking in court, by going to court. And uh, when at the end of the war, uh, when the when yeah when the war was over, uh, Mr. Burle uh, has been mentioned yesterday here. Mr. Burle he owned about 15 looted paintings from France. Unfortunately, none of these paintings have ever been given back, have ever been restituted. This is for the French administration. Uh, concerning the uh, uh, US auctioneers and US art dealers and US collectors, it is also true that they have never ever worried about looking for the provenance, looking for the history of these paintings. Sometimes the history of these paintings, the provenance of these paintings can be found in two hours, in one afternoon. I have done it. Uh, we can see the next uh, painting they do admit that they do not want to give them back, even though officially they say that they are going to do it. If we can go back again to the room so you will see and I will tell you the story. The attitude of the Swiss during the war is whoever we can help, no matter what, if we can make money, let's do it. That was the Swiss attitude during the war, and they have to acknowledge that. In the history of these paintings is that, uh, let's say, a very important part, aspect of the history has been avoided.